Care to visit Paradise, Miss Dios? Paradise? Does the boat go to Elysium? Oh, to Corfu Island. A land with no work and all play. A vacation destination. Vacation? What's that? Oh, a state of mind where your only responsibility is to get much needed rest. It's a new concept. It does sound tempting. There are no clearer waters than off the coast of Corfu. How about soldiers? Criminals? People. That's who I really need a break from. <laughs> if there are, they're too busy relaxing. Can I interest you in today's passage? It's just what I need. Vacation. For a couple of days, at least. Ah, uh -huh, then step aboard! Your next destination, Bliss. sun too long. You're more bronze than an urn. Come down here. Ah, nonsense. I'm taking in the air. Much needed rest. Okay. Bye. What if I told you a, a mythical treasure awaits? Huh? What say you then? Nothing I haven't heard before. But an expert like you will find it in no time. The address the needs a tune-up, and I could use the drachmi. <laughs> Help an old friend. Uh, right. For all time's sake. <laughs> all right, all right. Just... Just keep your heat on. <gasps> uh. Not as quick on oh. her feet anymore, is she? <laughs> <clears throat> What's all this about treasure? Only the most exciting thing to happen to you in ages! I've had enough excitement for a lifetime. This was the last place we thought to look for you on Corfu. What have you been doing all on your own? Nothing, dear Irovados. And I've had the time of my life. Napping in the day, stargazing at night, and as much wine as I can swallow. That's quite unlike you. The old Cassandra, maybe. But the new Cassandra has never felt better. Not retiring, are you? As long as there's trouble in this world, I don't see that happening. I... Never seen you with a face so sour. Come on now. Everybody loves treasure. I'm not really in the mood. I'm a little preoccupied. Not in the mood. Now you're definitely not acting like yourself. What's so bad about that? I'm fine. Really, I just needed to be alone for a while. To think about what's become of my life and to get away from everyone. No offense. None taken. <laughs> it's true. The burdens you've carried have been heavy. If anyone can shoulder them, it's Cassandra. You just need a little distraction from the weight. Say you'll do it. Come on the hunt for the Adrestia. For me. All right. We'll hunt for treasure to put some drachmi in your pocket. That's our mystios! <laughs> oh, the loot will be enough for a whole new ship! <clears throat> Legends say 
There are delicate linens woven by goddesses. Ancient scrolls, one of a kind wares from a far off land. <laughs> Let's not get too carried away, Barnabas. Oh, right. I won't spoil any surprises. You'll find clues around the island that will lead to treasures beyond imagination. If it's so legendary, I'm surprised no one's found it yet. They've tried for hundreds of years! Well, less than that, but no one has discovered it. Not until we do today. We'll see. The only thing this island has a lot of is sand and pirates. I'll go get my gear. With all my old things here, I'm starting to forget about them. All the people I've met, it's like they follow me around. Physically and in my head. I was hoping to not need these for a while. Time to get back in shape. The very intriguing, riveting clues are waiting for you. Barnabas, careful. What? Too much? Wait. Who wrote this? Messy, like it was scrawled on a bobbing ship. Just like the hand of Varnavas. Legendary treasure, eh? Seems more like Varnavas and Irodotos thought I was on vacation too long. Those two. All right, boys. Where do you want me to go next? <laughs> Actors playing pirates. Nice touch. Those two outdid themselves. What did you find there, Let's make this a good fight for our audience, shall we? Ready to die! It's time! Not a bad performance. Have you all acted before? We know you know. <sighs> what do I know? The treasure. Don't lie. You were sniffing around. Yes. That's what people do when they're on treasure hunts. We'll find it first. Mark my words. I'm guessing that wasn't a play fight. There's no playing with those kinds of riches are at stake. But those clues were written by Herodotus and Varnavas, weren't they? What clues? What? What? How do you know about the letter of the treasure hunter? Wait. Let's start over. There is very real treasure on Corfu Island, isn't there? Don't matter. Not when you'll never see it. You'll be locked in there for the rest of your miserable days. We'll see about that. Oh, where's my gear?
Herodotus can read this. You're alive! I suppose now you'll tell me your treasure hunt wasn't real. Barnabas thought you needed some more adventure in your life. I know you. You're just like me. You live to see the next port, so to speak. I thought it'd do you some good to feel needed again. You two must have really missed me to go to all this trouble. Of course we did. We all love wine, but drinking all on your lonesome? Eh, you can't blame us for being a little worried. A few of her clues still remain on the island if you want to find them. To humor us. We put a lot of work into those. Hope a pirate doesn't find them first. Speaking of clues, real clues, I found this letter. This is written in an ancient Dorian dialect. Uh, I can read parts, but it's not spoken. And most of its stories have died with its speakers. Remarkable. What does it mean? I don't exactly know, but it alludes to a story I heard once. It told of a sunken key in a temple off the coast of Corfu, near a small island. Aha! Oh, keys always unlock. Something. Our hunt isn't over yet. Thank the gods. A sunken key. That doesn't narrow it down when you're surrounded by water. You were a little reluctant at first, huh? <laughs> but now, this is for real. The three of us will make history. It's not exactly the break I had in mind. I came here to get away from everything, remember? But? But we're involved now, whether I like it or not. Oh, that's the spirit! Where to? I believe an old colleague of mine, a professor, lives on the island. He may be able to translate the letter's true meaning. I'll see what he knows in Korkirapolis. I'll meet you there. Barnavas, you take him. I'm sure the pirates will be looking for that letter. Affirmative! Then I'll head to the port. <laughs> you wouldn't believe the dry reams built out of Corfu! So this is turning into Varnavas' vacation, is it? the doors at the professor's house. Hope they found what this key unlocks. Look. What happened here? Where are they? Maybe I can find something useful. No wonder this sandal broke. It was hardly held together. It must have come from a poor area of Corfu. This better be the place. Not here. There sure is a lot of marble. Maybe the pirates smuggle it out of the quarry. It's worth a try. That body. No. No, it can't Buy be. Me some free at last. It's not here. I have to find him.
behind you. You want your friend to live? Hand it over. I don't know what you're talking about. He's a storyteller, Mistios. He squealed like a hog. I want that key. You have plenty of bounty around the island. Why this treasure? Bah! <laughs> Some treasure hunter you are. The most famous of all treasure hunters plundered the most valuable goods known to mortal man and hid them on Corfu. His name was lost to time, but his tale survived. He hid it away for the day his son would become a hunter like him and find the clues he left behind. But the fool died as only fools do, and the treasure turned to legend until now. The key, or he dies. That's the bus. Take it. No! You don't know what the treasure contains. <laughs> Have at them, boys. Is that... Fire!
clear. What happened? It's like it's asleep. Dead. This can't be right. My spear has never felt like this. Where did Herodotus go? And what happened to Varnavas? Is that you? We need to talk. Varnavas! How did you find us? It's a little morbid, but I followed the trail of bodies and it brought me here. I tried to follow the pirates who took Irodotos, but I, I couldn't quite keep up. Are you both all right? Never mind that. Did you see that star shoot across the island? A sign from the gods, no doubt. Not a star, Barnabas. An artifact. The letter spoke of a gold object among the treasure, so powerful it turns men into their darkest fears. Or into monsters, literally and metaphorically. I've fought them myself. Surely you're joking. I've dealt with these artifacts before. They're as dangerous as the letter said. What mythical power! Who knows what this one's capable of? It breaks spears, for one thing. Are you sure? It looks like the same spear of Leonidas to me. Trust me, something's... off. I'm sure it's fine. Allow me to fix it. I know ships aren't spears, but sea captains are good handy men. I appreciate the thought, but I know my spear. It's nothing like a ship. I can't help but feel like this whole mess is my fault. Don't. I'll go see what can be done, and I'll find you two later. Good. Why don't we go see those waterfalls you were telling me about, Barnabas? Ah, yes! I have not yet paid my respects to Asopos. He's god of the river here, and won't be pleased with all our hubbub. Stay safe. No more pirates. Keeper. Where do I go? The tomb of Phaeax, hidden in ruins. Come alone. Go west of the waterfalls. Go to the north. We'll meet there. North. This is the place Alethia mentioned. Now, to find a way in. With my spear broken, I'd better be careful. Alethia? You found me, Keeper. Why all the secrecy? A precaution. Mortal eyes can't see what I have to show you. Well, before you do... I don't know what happened. I went to take an artifact like I've done before, and... Can you fix it? Unfortunately, I cannot. There must be a way. My grandfather's spear... Is most likely useless. The spear of Leonidas was overwhelmed by the Isu energies it held. Some force in the artifact must have pushed it to its limits. So it's gone? After all it's done for me? I'm afraid so. But your powers are not limited to the spear. Your oath as keeper of the staff makes your destiny much more complex. Let me show you. What? Am I looking at, exactly? The world. The planet Earth where you live. And on it are all its people. Good and bad. Innocent and knowing. Peaceful and violent. 
These are the places where you will find the world's Isu artifacts. They lie hidden, for now. There's more of them? Who put them there? They aren't there without reason. But we aren't always wise to the why and who. They serve a mysterious purpose. What are you saying? There is a task that lies ahead for the Keeper of the Staff, if you are willing to take it. A task that will take the rest of your mortal life. Undisturbed, the artifacts are no threat, but if found by the wrong kind, human life may be destroyed. So, my spear has no power, and I have to leave the world I know to find more of the things that took it away? Things that turned people to monsters? Yes, to stop more monsters from existing. You're asking me to leave my home. To leave everyone I love. It is a sorry fact, but that will happen no matter what you do. They're mortal. One day, they will die. Look, I came to you to have my spear fixed. If you can't do that, then I'm leaving. You know their power, Keeper. Their potential. Humanity does not. I didn't ask for this! Maybe I don't want to live forever. Don't I get a say in my own fate? Forget you, and forget the artifacts. I'm leaving. Consider what I've said. So my spear is broken, and I'm being asked to find countless artifacts around the world. Forever. Happy vacation, Cassandra. This is too much. How could I ever explain this to Irodotos and Varnavas? They'd never understand. What to say when I find them? Cassandra, we have a problem. Where's Varnavas? He took off alone to find the object that broke your spear. What? Has he gone mad? I tried to explain to him it would be fruitless, but he wouldn't listen. He thought finding it was the answer. You should have stopped him. Do you understand what that thing can do? He wanted to help. So he does that, instead of staying out of trouble? I have to find it before Varnavas does. Malaka! When I find you, Varnavas, what were you thinking going after it? Definitely landed here, but no sign of Arnavas. 
Let's take a look around. By the gods! Thank you, Mistios! Who here can tell me what happened? A man was here. He tore up our farm. Not one man. Ten. Twenty. One at a time. What did he look like? He was a one-eyed madman. Nothing he touched was safe. He burned my crops. No, he was over there destroying my stall. He was everywhere. All right. Cassandra, I believe it's true. Varnavas found the artifact. If the letter was right, this object has the power to corrupt its holder beyond recognition. It is true. I've looked into the eyes of the monsters they make. The people inside won't come back. They can't come back. And the artifact? How could we possibly take it away from the very beast it's created? I don't know. There has to be some way. But if he's too far gone... I can't think that far ahead. Not yet. What can we do? I have to find Varnavas before it's too late. But the pirates are after him. Soldiers would kill him for the damage he's caused. I have to try. I won't let it take him. Follow his chaos. It seems like he headed towards Cassiope. Hurry! Try to stay out of sight. Did I see something? Great and powerful Zeus, I am not well. Call your son Apollo. Cure me of this madness. I, I will do anything. Barnavas. Cassandra. Oh, Cassandra, you have to help me. Something's very wrong. I know, Varnavas, I know. You have to give me the artifact. I'm scared. I know you are. Just hand it over, all right? What? It's causing you to act this way. If you give me the artifact, everything will be okay. But it protects me! It's the only thing that keeps me safe! I know you're still in there. Can't you see what it's doing to you? With this, I don't have to be afraid anymore. <laughs> I've been a weakling and a coward, and now I'm as powerful as a god. The real you would never say that. Give it to me. It is mine! Stop! I don't want to hurt you. You are powerless. <laughs> Ah! 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 
lies not in your brawn, but your heart. No, please! Do not kill me. I surrender. Please. It's not the real you! Saved me. Remember Cassandra? That's when our journey began. Don't end it now. Stop it! Oh gods, let me not be killed. Let Cassandra spare me. Forgive me, Barnavas. I have to weaken it. I have to keep going. Not real. They're not real. I'm. I'm so weak. Please, don't hurt me. I won't hurt you. Just give me the artifact. Help me, please. Who am I? What's become of me? You're Barnavas. My friend, if you keep it, you'll be someone else forever. You are no friend. You are going to leave me as soon as you have it. I will not let fear take me. Don't make me do this. That is precisely what I will make you do. Unless you are the one who is afraid. going to leave a mark. Oh, no question. <laughs> Did it hurt you? Uh, it got me all right, but I won't lose it. <laughs> Thank the gods. Whoever heard of a man with one arm and one eye? <laughs> uh, though I am slightly embarrassed, I really thought I was on to something there. <laughs> what were you thinking going after the artifact? How could you be so stupid? Who cares about your arm when you could have died? At least my intentions were good. You have no idea what almost happened. I almost killed you. Oh, don't worry. I'm as sturdy as a military ship. Listen to me. I'm immortal. Get it? You are not. You make mistakes, and you die. Gone. And you leave everyone else to deal with it. Immortal? Truly immortal? Yes. Immortal. Surprise. <laughs> I knew you had the God's touch! Everyone I love. I have to leave behind. And I almost had to leave you. Forever. Cassandra, it is the mortal way. 
We all go when the gods say so, and I eagerly await an afterlife of calm seas and bottomless crab cakes. It's not funny. Maybe not, but did we ever have fun today? That's what matters, eh? We don't know how long we have the present, but it's a gift as good as gold. Gold? You did take me on a treasure hunt after all. And all I got was a busted arm. <laughs> Let's get you patched up. Keeper, see for yourself. You are a protector of men, an intermediary of our world and theirs. Your journey will take you to lands of kings, queens, and conquerors, over water and through fire, into revolution and rebellion. But your presence will mean peace, Keeper. Take up this task. For them, and for yourself. That's one treasure hunt over. But there's still another one out there. Maybe I should look for Herodotus and Barnabas. I can squeeze a few more drops out of this vacation. Herodotus and Barnabas will be waiting for me. Well, you can't say I wasn't successful in getting Cassandra out of her funk. Out of my funk, but into a lot more trouble. Oops! <laughs> Did I already apologize for that? <laughs> Coming to Corfu, I had no inkling that we would get caught up in a tale of legendary treasure. They say life gets dull without surprises. Now that's a reason to cheers! And to you, Icaros. Yes. We all have but one life to lead. We have to do the most with it. One life? Speak for yourself. You're right, Barnabas. Heroes like Cassandra will live on in the stories and legends of their triumphs. They live forever. Listen. I want you two to know... I'll be leaving soon. To travel across waters I've never dreamed of crossing. And I don't know when I'll be back. You're leaving? Again? Where? Why? I'll go wherever I'm needed in the world. I can't run from my responsibilities. Someone... I mean... something... tells me my journey's not over yet. We couldn't possibly keep you for ourselves. Though you'll be everywhere in my writings, that's for certain. I'm honored. Maybe you could give me one of your manuscripts, Irovatos. I'm sure even those from far-off lands would love to read it. <laughs> Don't trouble yourself. These lands will do for now. But if you're serious, a storyteller is always prepared. Take it, but feel no need to share it. It's for you. I have something for you too. No. The spear. You knew what it was the moment you met me. But I've outgrown it. It's yours now. Careful. It's still sharp. I'll cherish it forever. Well, though I'm not one to refuse a gift, the, the gift of friendship is enough for me. You only want friendship? I guess I'll need to find another second-in-command for my trip. Me? Traveling the world? With you? If you'll have me as your captain. 
I don't know how much longer these old bones can hoist a sail. But I'll go as far as I can. The Adrestia is yours. What will be your first stop, Cassandra? I don't know. What I do know is that I need a new weapon. Egypt has always fascinated me. Ah, one of my favorite places. Let me tell you one of my best stories. Everyone will read your words, Herodotus. Hey, 